In this video, how to fix secure boot enabled but secure boot status disabled on Lenovo laptops. As you can see, on this ThinkBook laptop, secure boot is enabled, but the secure boot status is disabled. To fix this, let's click Restore Factory Keys. Click Yes to install the keys. Save the changes and restart the computer. As you can see, Secure Boot and its status are now enabled. Another example is on an IdeaPad laptop. Secure Boot is enabled, but the Secure Boot status is disabled. Move the highlight to restore factory keys and hit Enter. Press Enter again to restore the factory keys. Save the changes and restart the computer. As you can see, it works as expected now. On Windows, you can check if Secure Boot is enabled. The first way, you can check it using the System Information app. The value displayed will indicate on if Secure Boot is enabled, off if it is disabled, and unsupported if it is not compatible with your hardware. The second way, you can check it from the Windows settings. Select Privacy and Security. Windows Security. Device Security. As you can see, the Secure Boot is on. And the last way, you can also query the Secure Boot status from PowerShell. You'll see true if Secure Boot is enabled, false if Secure Boot is disabled, and this if it is not compatible with your hardware. That's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and see you in the next videos.